next guest got an invitation to the 225, also known as the President's Bipartisan Televised Health Care Meeting on February 25th. Does anyone know what to expect? Republican Congressman Joe Barton joins us live. Congratulations, Congressman. You're going to the, you got the hottest ticket in town. Everybody would love to go to this meeting. Um, what do you know about this meeting? Do you even know um, whether you're going to be sitting in a circle, whether there's a podium? Do you know anything about the sort of logistics of it? <laughs> well, it's kind of like an invitation to one of these weekends at a resort. You know, you know you're invited and you say no strings attached, but you're a little bit worried there has to be a catch somewhere. Uh, we're delighted to be invited. I'm privileged to be the ranking Republican on the Energy and Commerce Committee, which is how I got my invitation. Uh, if the president wants a real dialogue and a real discussion of solutions, uh, we'll be ready. If, on the other hand, we're just stage props for another photo op, uh, you know, I think that's a disservice not just to us but to the American people. What do you hear instead? I realize you're not in the halls of Congress right now, but what do you hear? Is the intention both sides, including the Democrats, are, are they coming with, uh, op, you know, are they willing to sort of scrap their bill and are Republicans willing to sort of open their arms and embrace different conversation talk? Or, or is, this, is everyone sort of thinking like, well, this is, this is nice, but? Well, you know, when I talked to Chairman Waxman the week before we left Washington, before the big snow, um, uh, he was reluctant to start with a clean sheet of paper. Uh, we, we've, been, we've heard rumors that uh, they're going to release a bill before the summit, and we'll, just, we'll hear them praise that bill. I hope that's not the case. Uh, John Boehner, the Republican leader in the House, has presented the president with some of our health care proposals. Uh, you know, if, if, they, if they really want a solution, let's start with a clean sheet of paper. And I might point out that, that our motto in the House Republican Conference is bipartisan or bust, because if we're partisan, we, we're outvoted by 80 votes. So for us to be successful, we have to be bipartisan. And uh, we're just hopeful the president is sincere in his invitation. Do you even know um, how long this meeting is supposed to be on the 25th? <laughs> well, you know, I went to two of the early summits last year, uh, and uh, those each took about two hours. The president made a presentation and some of his cabinet members, and one of them we then went into uh, focus groups and then came back. Uh, the other one we just sat and listened. We were kind of a, an audience for the president and his, some of his uh, cabinet off officers to talk to us. Uh, you know, if they're really serious, maybe we'll meet in the Roosevelt Room or the cabinet room. And, you know, on the other hand, if we, we, we meet in the... Um, out in one of the larger rooms with a big audience, uh, it's less likely that it's going to be a substantive discussion. But the, the honest answer, Greta, is uh, we really don't know what the format's going to be, or at least I don't I'll know. I'll tell you, it's even intriguing whether you guys have assigned seating, whether you're mixed up or sitting by party or whatever. <laughs> anyway, Congressman, thanks. We're going to all be watching very carefully because it's going to be on C-SPAN, so we'll be watching. Thank you, sir.